Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Dominations! So, guys, today is the, oh, I should say this weekend, is the horse and wagon weekend. So that means the heavy cavalry and the supply cart, they train uber, uber fast. So uh, that's why today I want to show you some raids with horses and wagons. But first, let's go to the defense replay. I got attacked by this uh, Spanish player. With the name of Asterix. So uh, let's see how we did. Um, yeah, as you see, two of my catapults are still upgrading to mortar. So don't expect too much from my base. So uh, he actually uh, attacks from the left hand side here. With some uh, archers and then also some uh, other troops. And all my troops managed to uh, yeah, fend them off quite well. But then he breaks in with the elephant. And uh, with some more troops. And with the Colosseum Blessing. And then he just uh, put another protect spell on him. That's how he managed to destroy my HQ. And then he tries to kill my mortar. But uh, yeah, then uh, a lot of his troops die. And then uh, he fails. So I think my base did quite well. Especially because... Uh, yeah, all my uh, mortars are still upgrading, so uh, yeah, it's going good, guys. I can't wait to max it all out, and then uh, see how uh, people attack me, and then see them all buy against my base, because that's uh, what I su suspect to happen. So, let's go to my uh, horse and wagon raid. As you guys all know, the Lancer doesn't do much damage against resource buildings. That's why I brought a few raiders to... Uh, yeah, I just dropped them in the end to kill the rest of the buildings if uh, if the Lancers destroyed all the defensive buildings. So, because they already do not so much damage, um, I will bring my Nobunaga. And I will... I won't um, use Blessings, just to show you this uh, is possible without Blessings. I have the goods for it, so... Shall I do use blessings? Okay, for the first one, I will use blessings. Put a weapon blessing. Put an armor blessing. So, okay, there we go. Let's raid, guys. Um. <laughs> yeah, this guy is a little bit too. Too easy, maybe. But, uh, yeah. Okay, let's just attack this player, because he's easy. And I just want to destroy his base. Just uh, pop all this. It seems that all the supply cards are healing in general. What's going on, guys? What's going on here? Okay, the supply cards are actually going towards my cavalry now. Oh, the blizzard, the blizzard tower was trying to snipe off my uh, supply wagons. I don't know if he succeeded, but uh, if so, he took only uh, took out only one. Yeah, as you see, guys, this uh, strategy goes really, really slow compared to my uh, usual strategy. They, usually, I kill uh, bases really quick, but uh, these uh, lancers don't have much damage, so you just uh, yeah, I have to give them some time. To kill everything. And uh, yeah, the only one who do great damage is my General Nobunaga. He does over 400 damage. He kills the buildings with a few sweeps, guys. Look at that. He's an amazing dude. Amazing fella. Mr. Nobunaga. He's my favorite hero now, man. Much better than uh, Cleopatra. So, my horses are still busy. Killing defensive buildings. So... Yeah, my uh, supply cars are doing a good job now. The <laughs> Lancers are not losing any health. Even uh, the Ballista Tower cannot uh, do too much against my Lancers. So. Okay, guys. I guess that's it. Uh, I can uh, just drop my readers as well.
And now I wonder how much I lost. I don't think it's so much, guys. I think I think I did pretty well here. I think we can do another raid. Just in the video, guys. Yeah, it's quite fun to raid low level players with uh, Lancers and Supply Wagons. So, uh, yeah, I only lost one Supply Wagon. Because uh, the Ballista fired on the Supply Wagon, so... Okay, that was cool. So, we retrain. And it only takes 3 minutes, guys, so... Uh, yeah, let's just... Uh, <laughs> Continue with four supply wagons, I guess that's enough. Um, one crown. Yeah, let's just use Cleopatra for now. Hope she does a better job this time. So now I do the same thing, but without blessings. And you can see how I would normally attack. How it normally would go. Of course, uh, <laughs> we would choose an easy player, because uh, the lessons take quite some time. Yeah, even the 66. It's maybe just a bit too much. Also, he doesn't have much loot anyway, so I wouldn't want to raid him. Uh, 37, guys. 37. Let's raid the dude. See, it's going great, the troops. Of the enemy, I'm not focusing my supply wagon, so this way, uh, yeah, my uh, lancers can just uh, keep moving and uh, my general will take care of the troops. Yeah, guys, if you don't want to lose troops and just want to uh, kill easy bases, this is the way to go, man. This is uh, so funny. I guess uh, the guy with this low level account will be so pissed because <laughs> uh, he won't get any. Anything, not not even uh, crowns that he destroyed some troops, man. <laughs> yeah, this is cool. I can drop my radars to finish everything off. It seems that I didn't lose anything, guys. <laughs> I didn't lose any troops, so uh, we can just uh, continue raiding and get this loot, get his diamonds, get his trade goods, get his uh, soul, get his pride and eat his uh, soul alive. That's how we fight. Just get a 5 star, 5 star bases, destroy faces. That's how I raid guys. Look at that, another not a drop of blood spilled from my awesome lancers, guys. Look at that. Hey, <laughs> let's go continue raining. Oh, I love this. Uh, I love this tactic now. Oh, this is so epic, guys. This is so epic. Let's see. Hey, and Alexander is ready. You see, guys, if you get a five star and your general is still alive, you can just use it. Also, after uh, five or ten minutes. So you can keep using generals, it's so cool. Oh, I love this strategy, guys. I love it. I love it, love, love it. Another low-level player, guys. What shall we do? Tech him, of course. With a lot of lancers. And a lot of supply wagons to make sure my lancers never die. Hey, I drop my general. To get a bit of damage or keep away annoying troops. So... Uh, yeah, this strategy is cool, guys. It's just awesome, uh, awesome help. Never die. That's all. That's all about. It's called horse and wagons, and I especially do this because there's a horse and wagons event where the horse and wagons uh, train uh, five times faster than normal. So if you want to do this, you better do it now, cause uh, yeah, you can train up your troops really, really fast. Like crazy fast, guys. Like a banana, that's fast.
Yeah, it seems that my troops are just not dying. So that's really cool. You have to have some patience with this strategy, but uh, yeah, you don't need to retrain your troops. So yeah, it's really cool, guys. It's really, really cool. Oh, unfortunately, another supply cart died. So, but I don't know what the supply cards are doing. They should follow my troops. But I think they were just stuck here because a general was over here or something. <laughs> so let's... Uh, Use more troops from the alliance to hurry this up a bit. Um, fortunately, I lost all my supply cards, so that wasn't very that wasn't very cool. You could look, can do the same thing, I think, without the supply cards, because if you have a lot of lancers. I don't think those low-level Melissa Towers can actually kill the Lancers, so you will uh, also do more damage. So. Let's see how, it, how long it trains uh, Lancer. Yeah, let's kill one raider and then uh, train here also to Lancer. So within, within one minute I will show you uh, all Lancer raid and uh, yeah, just uh, with a with few raiders to uh, clear things up. So it will be cool guys. Will be so super cool. Yeah, so it's really a really a nice way to clear low level players because uh, yeah, these lancers uh, really have a lot of HP. <coughs> Excuse me. So <coughs> ah, sorry guys. Yeah, I'm on my way to uh, Max in Gunpowder. I don't care about his farms and caravans, but for the rest of things, uh, yeah, almost everything is Max. Or almost Max, or Max within like a week or two weeks. So yeah, that will be really cool. So let's do a final raid. This time with uh, only Lancers. You see how it goes. This guy's maybe a little bit uh, too hard for it yeah this base could be but he doesn't have a lot of troops a lot of loot I mean uh, this is definitely too hard this base is a little bit hard but yeah it's doable I guess uh, especially if I come from the north because he doesn't have any Melissa Tower or good, uh, yeah, he doesn't have any good defense against uh, Lancers from here, so I thought this was a good idea to start from here. Oh, guys, I forgot my general. What am I doing? So, hopefully, we'll still get the win. Um, till now, my readers are. Uh, my lances are doing a good job. They're just killing defensive buildings like they should. Uh, they're not stopped too much by uh, by enemy troops. So they're destroying the wall now to kill the castle. I think. Yep. 
Are this uh, so Lazarus here alone? 